Hello guys, Art 1000 here, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys a tutorial on the uh, Talk and Tie uh, side view system for battles on RPG Maker VX Ace. Now the RPG Maker starts off with kind of just, um, I'll just show you guys, like a first person kind of battle system I guess, so I'm just going to give you guys a little example here as to put my guy jacked, level 99, initialize. So, um, what we're going to do is I'm going to show you basic, uh, what it's like if you guys know RPG Maker VX Ace. It starts off first person. So, yeah, you got the basic, um first person battle style so what you're gonna need to do is first download the uh, talk and tie um, battle system thing I'll include the link in the description and um, you'll get a project that looks just like this this is uh, kinda what I got and this is the newest version as of right now in the future it might change it might not who knows but um, as, this is what it lo the actual talk and tie system looks like it's actually pretty cool let you guys see it. Yeah, so that's just a basic idea. Alright, so first what you're going to want to do is open up your script editor, which is right up here on the talk and tie. Um, project and in your normal project what you'll notice is all these files excluding this one right here are not in so what you're gonna wanna do is just copy and paste those into your file I created a basic uh, file right here script editor as you can see there's nothing down here so we'll paste uh, the first one right here and uh, just uh, pretty much just keep going with that So you're pretty much going to copy and paste all of these right into your system. What sucks is that they're all in uh, Japanese, but you know, what can you do? It's talking Thai, Japanese guy made it, so not that big of a deal. So anyways, um, now you got your scripts uh, into your script thing. Now what you're probably going to want to do is say, oh shit, I'm going to go and start a battle now, but really if you open up a battle you're gonna get something that looks like this let's battle test well actually no the pro scripts probably didn't verify yet let me check again okay oh yeah have to save save project battle test unable to find it. now what that means is um, there it's looking for pictures that come with the uh, talk and tie system so I'm gonna show you exactly how to get those pictures so you're gonna go to your resource manager in the talk and tie system and all these red dots right here is what you want to import back into your system like the shadow and all that all those are 100 percent necessary all these pictures for um, animations and whatnot they're 100% necessary you need to have those luckily I already saved them into a file just I'll, I'll give you a basic idea just take it export it to like say your desktop or whatever and it'll export as a as the picture file or whatever but I'll just import them all since I already have them all saved into a uh, separate file so yeah let's just uh, do that real quick right here desktop so yeah your battle back C look C X1 doesn't matter that import
just gonna get a little idea of what else to oh yeah you need you need those in the characters as well just the actor files and whatnot import those actor one Also gonna need the animals too. Arrow. Is there like a bow file too? Arrow bow. Hmm. And shadow. Those ones go into your uh, character file right there. And next is the uh, pictures. This one's important for um, abilities and whatnot. When you put all the ones in the pictures, these ones are these four right here are optional. They just add like faces and whatnot. You don't really need to add those. This one's also optional, but I'll just put it in anyways. But the actor ones are completely optional for your pictures. But uh, I'll start importing all the ones here. Backwind. Circle Oh shit, I don't even think you're supposed to put those in there, but whatever that's not gonna hurt anything. Yeah, you're not circle and then magic Pretty much you just copy it just like the way it is and uh your save file right there and next is the uh, white yeah that's it for that one and the next one is system and I believe that's the last one that you need to do to copy for pictures yes it is so that's just all your damage stuff so this one will be um, pretty fast too. just import all your uh, damage files that it comes with And now all of your pictures are completely um, imported into your system. So that's all you really need to do for the picture part. Now you're probably going to want to load up the game again and say, Oh, now I got the pictures, now I can do a battle test. So let's just try that. <laughs> As you can see, it now works. However, let's change. I, I would change his um, TP to something different, but next area. As you can see, that just gets all messed up and whatnot because in your uh, talk and tie, it does. Talk and tie has uh, different animation files than your actual project does. So X out of this. Now I'll go to the uh, side view. And in your data, write this. This is the file right here that you're going to want into your actual project file. So just go to uh, the project file that you have. Tutorial, whatever. And you're going to want to copy and paste the animations file from your talk and tie um, s data file into your project data file. And it should say something like that. Just copy and replace it. And now, say project again. If it doesn't work, then it didn't copyright. But now, when you do um, skills, it should work. So let's give this another try here. Yeah, it didn't copy properly. Let's check that again. Yeah, see, as you can see, the file size right over here didn't copy 100% completely. It was my fault. Happen happened on my other uh, game file as well. But you copy and paste it, copy and replace, whatever.
Okay, let's try this again. Always remember to save your project. That's extremely important to remember that right there. So this should work. Man, again, it's just messing with me. Keeps not copying properly, but pretty much um what's gonna want what you're gonna want to do is here I'll just open up um, a different file that I've been working on here as you can see well this is just all my maps and stuff you don't really need uh, that but it's got the exact same animations file that it does in the talk and tie so uh, when you open up your project project 2 so yeah this is the game I've been working on you pro guys have probably been seeing it on my channel now this one actually fully copied the file right into your thing. As you see, abilities uh, fully work. So um, yeah, that's a full tutorial on that. So uh, like, comment, subscribe, favorite, whatever you got to do if you have the time. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.